good morning, sir. I do wear more boy, boy. A caro and your money, ja. Or to tomorrow, there were no Jama, the wine. Now, quite no cool Nigeria or to tom money in the Nigeria. Oh, no, watch a high name. Could I call long? So make you the listen, make you the watch every time on top of Zobia TV. Make you the watch. Good morning, Niger and Sir Prince. <laughs> yes, so shy your teeth. Eh, you get one like what just success. No matter condition, fair, yeah. yeah. All right, back to something we don't make us smile at all, because this one a controversial topic. And uh, when they talk about should older people retire early to reduce youth unemployment? No, be just a frivolous statement, though. Now, the Pope, now he talk this one. And of course, we get our great panel. We're going to discuss that this morning. We have our very own Dibanj in the building. We're going to follow up Mr. Dakovanjo Day inside the studio. And of course, we get a very, very handsome and uh, velt uh, Mr. Mr. Bernard Kede. You go see how I describe oh, yeah. that differently. Yeah. This one I'm at, oh, that one I'll cheat. Oh. I see. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, make a lady premise for this particular discussion. They say our Pope, Pope Francis, on Wednesday, he they talk, he call for a renewal on top of social justice. He told say make older people, make their leave work early. Or make they reduce the work that they do to create work for younger generation. He told say this will not become something where they're very urgent to make we do our more because it they impact the social network. That we should reduce the working hours of the people them we don't old. So that younger people go figure work. Now be the ten, long, long and short of everything when he talk. He talk this off when they do currently linked Italian trade union. And I dare talk him. He says society, where they force old people to work for too long, and force an entire generation of young people not to see work, they say they're they stupid and short-sighted. Pope Francis will be 80 years old. Will be 80 years old. He also says, say, May they make sure say they get better healthy working culture. Where no go be just culture of leisure, where people go just they lie, 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 lie down. But may they get hard working people where laziness no day inside their body. Now some of the things the way Pope Francis been talk. So we want to discuss it this morning. Do you think this our very young Pope has a valid argument? <laughs> because at 80, <laughs> some will say, why don't you give the position to a younger? Pope that has the tenacity and the energy to run the papacy. Uh, make we remember, say, the position of the Pope to now by appointment. Mm. Yeah. So, so if, if, the, if, the, 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 if the contest, Pope, uh -huh, if the Pope will be 80 now, never come out for there, it be like, say, um, the work where they appoint him for, too. In suppose don't abdicate, sorry for the big mm. English, uh -huh, leave him for other people, maybe they can't do him because right. what. What exactly is self you feel get from an 80-year-old man wasting day for active service? So if the Pope, they release that kind of information for how, uh, I mean, to they tell people because of social justice mm. and all of those things, then make Pope talk to, to himself too. Make him come out there for like 50, 55-year-old person. Anyway, uh, that's just about the Pope. I don't know how they do for the Vatican. Mm. And so I don't know the many criteria where they make person, they stay. Till that time, maybe now until death do the Pope part, part. in go come out as Pope for the or, for or the, the place. sickness or, do you part uh -huh, or something now? But make we quick establish for this kind uh, area where we come from for Nigeria. We get statutory two major conditions where people still they remain for service or when they, they come out for service. There is one we call it compulsory retirement. retirement. The age now sixty five. Mm. Voluntary retirement, the age now 60. So for Nigeria, they don't spell them. Now recently, one argument come, and this one is strictly for professors, people where they teach for school. Mm. So that the standard of education, where will they complain about all this, why? No go further, oh. come, day that down. Maru. They come say, make lecturers, the quality ones, we get the experience, we don't learn, we, we, we don't become professors, make them they stay in service till like 70. Now, the argument where they on top of this one too don't come out now. They say 
We, it is our, not be us, be the lecturer, who they ask you for this kind of thing. Mm. If I won't stay, now me go decide whether I go stay. Not be say you go come bring law, we go make me, me to stay. Me what stay. if at 65 I won't come out? Or I don't tire, or I won't go do something else. So waiting and talk for that place. And don't forget, say, this issue is, uh, was released in, in Italy. Yes. And, yes. and it has something to do with the way the society, you know, say, in a capitalist uh, country. Yes. So people wait on wait the day inside, I mean, where they walk, and then they stay there. Any environment or a nation where you get people, where they live longer, what do you do to, in that society? Hmm. You cannot make them to go and sit down because you will kill them, them early. You will just kill them. And in an environment where the government know they faithful to the laws of the land, like when pension is paid as at when due, you feel tell them, go out. Your pension will be paid. And you can be rest assured, say, all of them will live continuously mm. on top of the pension where they pay them. But when you know go pay the pension, or st one story go come after the other, mm. then these people want to continue to work. Because mm. some of them probably have children with three-day school. Of course. They still get a lot of responsibilities. Where they, many of them, don't forget, in that kind of country, mm. their houses, their mortgage, mm. and they are still paying. You know, I'm, I'm mm. just looking at it like, okay, older people, they go say that they add value to the work where they do. But what in the pub they talk, it not be like saying it no makes some little, little sense. Because every day, the population is increasing by the day. We are churning out students from universities every day. Let's even make this applicable to Nigeria. Because let's say, okay, that one I would you would even talk about. What do you think will happen in a home state like Nigeria that you have mentioned obvious problems? If you tell them to go and stay at home and give the younger ones a chance, are you sure that the Nigerian youth that we have now, can we even trust some positions into their hands? Well, just, just as you be, uh, as uh, Mr. Dakwa been talked earlier, it's relative to the time and the place where the Pope will make this statement. Remember, I said the Pope been the lay emphasis on Europe, being say uh, Italy, they inside Europe, and in there for Italy, for, mm -hmm. for Rome. But many of the things where, where, where they are applicable for those particular places, you know, if it happen for here. For example, Mr. Dakwa, don't talk already, say, you get some people, some elderly people, where they say, now with their pension, now they still pay picking school fees. Mm -hmm. Some of them, their children never enter school at early ages. It take before they enter school. Also, remember, say, we did for a country where we say, uh, we get people where, you know, uh, uh, natality rates, that's the word I'm looking for. It they very high with a born way for this part of the world. Mm. So you go see old man with on the old, he don't marry new young wife. The man on the old, don't they reach retirement stage, and uh, in children still they young. young. So also still coming back to waiting in don't talk. Pension no they, no today are sure. As at the time where your pension is supposed to come, you no come. You go to find other means to still take train your children. And even when the children don't finish school, to get work on their own self, you know they very, very regular as you suppose they. So you go see the parents train in Peking and go primary school, train and go secondary school, train and go university, train up for youth service. If finish, never get work, the parents still get the work to still support the children and still support the family. So it is very, very difficult to follow within the Pope talk for this particular side of the world. The challenge is there more here because uh, as people would always talk, uh, we know to get a functional society. For them, their society, they work. People say it's like clockwork. You know, say once 60 seconds don't reach, one minute don't enter. It's like a Swiss watch. Mm -hmm. But for here, you feel do 90 seconds, one minute never enter because the thing was supposed to be in no damn in no damn place. All right, we're going to need to leave our phone lines open for people where they out there so that they fit through their mouth on top of this matter. What do you think about the statement where the Pope don't come outside talk? Say, make the older people, we don't they work for inside any of the industries or sectors, or even if the federal government work, say, make they need to step aside now and step down or maybe retire early so that younger ones, if we take into the positions where the elder ones don't work at come out. Our phone line, they're officially open. And if you to call us on top of country numbers, we the 0127721951. Having a 0127721951. Or zero one two seven seven eight one nine five. Our toll free number stay there for you to call us. That now zero eight hundred Wazubia TV. Now I always like to talk on statistics. Now if you look from a statistic um, point of view, um, they say the active working population of Nigeria now now about one hundred and six million people. Now I mean say within the age grade of eighteen to sixty five. The acting, the active working population of the youth. Now they say if you now can't check the the youth where they look for work. But inside this country, as of 2016, there were about 78 million youths where they find 
work. Mm. Every year, our universities, mm. our college of education, mm. our they polytechnics, they, they, they mm. produce at least two million people where they enter the labor force. Now, are they trying to wonder, because if you put the statistics of young people mm. where they find work, and the elders, elders. Oh, they say, won't come out. Are we, are we creating job opportunities or are we just looking at replacement? Because some people don't uh, come out and uh, say, uh, that, replace, that this, is, this is what they with the argue from, mm. is replacement. Now, Luchi, now Luchi, 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 you, you know, you know, go, face see I'm, you know go face see I'm like that. If you look at me like that, the problem day for the hand of government. Only? A government, yes, first of all, government way they insensitive to ensure, say, then they, uh, then, then, then they make sure say, the nation, that country, they grow as your population, they grow. Nigeria, know they concern. We know they concern about, say, people they born, people they born, people they born. All students uh, are released as graduates from university. Nigeria is not concerned about that. Let me give you an example. And statistics, too. One road where we make for one area for Lagos in the 60s, when the number of cars where they ply that road, you can count the number of cars by your hand. That road still they are up to now. That time, maybe now like 50 cars they climb up. Today, now 1 million cars, they pass the same road, and we still leave them the way we're in there. And you expect that that road go day okay? It's, it's not possible. The same thing, houses where people, that time, when they build up, uh, families of two or three children, with daddy and mommy, maybe they'll be five, they live for there. But now, Plenty of people, they stay inside that same building. No town planning, no restructuring, no, you know, urban development. That's what, what we call them. Be, urban development means, say, eh, as the people, they plenty, you they make sure, say, space day to um, accommodate uh, them. We just hold them. Mm -hmm. We get a caller on top of the line. Good morning to you. God's will? God's will. God's will. God's Hello. will. Hello, good morning. All right, good morning to you. Hello, good morning. Good morning, God's will contribute. Okay, um, I want to contribute on the, on the topic. Go ahead. Um, judging from what the Pope has said, uh, and, and I kind of, okay, and I support what Mr. Bernard don't talk, actually, because for this, our part of the country, yeah, we don't get a stable um, economy, kind of, we will provide um, that kind level where the Pope don't talk. Now, for that side of the Pope, them day, as we talk I'm now, that the government feel heed to wait till they don't talk. But for this part of our country here, I don't think that would be very possible. And again, Lola made a very important um, notion. She talked, say, can the youth of these days, let me say, will they produce? I'm a youth as well, but I have to be very honest. Some of us are very, very notorious, and I'm, I'm trying to use the word notorious, but Maybe I'm I, I don't think they will handle some office with these older people they handle inside this country actually so that's my contribution thank you very much we we'll get another person on top of the line good morning john john from patakot hello john hello good, good morning. morning john good morning all right make your point sir yeah the point is that you see in nigeria most things will compare outside this country it's not just the same at all it's not even comparable uh, when you talk about what happens outside this country different from what I've seen here. In terms of the pension aspect, so many people have, have had their pension over almost two years now. They have not even been paid. And most of these people we are talking about right now, they have children. Their children are in school. Some of them have children. Uh -huh. You don't expect someone, so many people that even after for 50 years in the job, it depends on the pension or retiree or whatever. What they, you think they have is just different from what we even think at all. Nigeria, you know, most times, after two years, that is even when the pension funds are being released. And these people are in very total hardship. Their children are just there, great grandchildren are there. They barely can even pay their fees or even help themselves in terms of health rent. These are just one of the things the pensioners face in this part of the world. It's so painful. So, what is the criteria here? Someone will finish their work job after paying his. Um, for more than 35 years, then he comes again to start staying at home for almost one year plus. Now he's waiting for what? Pension and gratuity. I just don't know how this system works in this part of the world. Thank God you guys are all there. Tell the government, when a worker finishes or after his retirement or he's done his verification, in the next one or two weeks or in the next one or two months after his retirement, he should be paid his pension. 
That's why we have people like the media, people like you, people up there. Thank you very much, uh, John. Please. Mm. Thank you very much, John. John, don't make a particular comment. You see, a lot of times when we look at the statistics and we see the weight of youth that are being churned out every day, we cannot just look at the fact that we will, I love what Ruchi said. Are we creating job opportunities or replacing the old? Because if we follow by what the Pope is saying, I agree with Mr. Dapo's analogy. Imagine that somebody who you know that after you leave work, your pension is not guaranteed. How do you want that person to get the presence of mind to even live for the youth? How do you know that now we have youth that are not trained? Or we even have some set of youth that seem untrainable? Because any parastater now, like now look at job opportunities. There is no advertising you see for job. They'll tell you, they want 10 years experience. experience. They want you not to be older than 25, certain, yeah. a certain age. age. So even the job creators, I they have standard and criteria. When a 25-year-old is the one you want on a, uh, on a job to do a particular job, and you already expect 10, 10 years um, um, experience, where would the youth At have gotten that <laughs> experience? Did he get it spiritually? <laughs> but don't you think these things are control? It, it contradicts each other sometimes. Well, a little bit. I, I would like to enter for here. Uh, con concerning what Luchi has been talked before, say, are we just replacing or are we, should we be looking at creating jobs? Um, me, I would like to say, I'm saying uh, that the two sides now we're supposed to look, the two sides, left and right. It just be like a football team. You know, go say because you want to score goal, you only get 11 strikers when you go to your team. You go still get striker, midfielder, attacker, defender. The same way, if we want to increase our working population, or rather, if we want to put more people into the workforce, we will both create a job and look for replacement for the ones where they. Because if we say we just want to create a job alone, the ones where they, when they don't retire, they don't owe, some don't die, some don't, they don't feel work again, who will come fill those positions? And remember, I said, we still need some of these old people to train the young ones where they come. Mm. Experience is very, very valid. It's very important in certain places. Also, it has to do with the type of job where we they talk about. For example, you say, um, you know, for example, these professors where we've been talking earlier, right? We go need some of them for their old age because they don't see the they don't see the nitty gritty. They don't see everything. They don't start early. They don't they follow the track record from back to back until reach where they day. So we go need them at certain age to fill in that pos those positions. Also, we know say no be only white collar jobs, no be only nine to five jobs, no be only government job nine day. So of course we still need to create job opportunities. And this thing about creating job opportunities, no be only the government go do one. Of course, like Mr. Dakwa don't talk. The first, the first challenge lies on the government. The government just paved the way first. Before other people will come, they put their own effort inside small, small to complement. Thank God, say now for Nigeria, the issue of public private partnership not been there before, like as a day now. Mm -hmm. Now we don't say the government don't partner with other people so that as the government they provide job, we know already say our population as a day like this, so government not be create job for everybody. Ben, now, ben, ben, I don't like another problem. Another major I mean, problem. From an yeah. angle. Another major yes. problem, all the before you uh, talk. We say we have in sane society. Where things they work, where mm. people they follow law as it, it be. A lot of old people will not enter the workforce, mm. will lie about their age. Uh -huh. mm. Football age. They go still day in service mm -hmm. longer than when you even expect. Yes. Because the age degradation where they take enter the civil service yeah, now, now, already now force. So you go you go find that say then go stay there for a very longer time. And a government problem. Because from the beginning, government don't even do due diligence to ensure, say, people's age and then the laws of the land must be properly followed. Mm. Once you are put in for civil service, you must put in 35 years, no, 30 years of service and 65 years. If you are 45 and government employ you at the age of 15 mm. and you are put in 30 years, you must, it's, it's compulsory retirement. You are put in 30 years because it's either 30 years or you are age 65 to leave the civil service work. So it now depends on the entry age where you enter civil service. If we're talking about government structure, but if not the government structure, if na sons and sons, if na Ben and sons, I can be there mm -hmm. until oh, until I, 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 exactly. I so this thing is it still has to do with a it's still a government uh, thing Probably because we're still talking day. about jobs where government provide. Mm. Maybe all the ministries where they like the MDAs for Nigeria. We get uh, Nigeria. Benga on top of the this phone line from Lagos. Good morning, Benga. 
Good Helen, morning. Good morning, good morning to morning. you. Yes, I'm, I'm happy I'm hearing about this. I've been thinking about this thing for a very long time. Right now, the people that are older, they should retire because the, the rate of unemployment is higher than the people that are supposed to retire. Because you have used your age to life, it doesn't, it doesn't concern us. I am actually a graduate of 2006 from the university. I don't have a job, but I have a company of my own. I'm in Abuja, I based in Abuja. So what I'm saying is that for the, for the people behind me, for them not to suffer, let them allow these guys retire. Look for proper channels to make sure that, yes, this guy has one wife. You know, they don't do proper research. They just allow people to come and lie. And before you know it, they'll stay there and be old and cannot walk. Go to second secretariat in Abuja, you'll be shocked. That place is a mess. The building is dirty. The people are old. They are just, in fact, I'm, I'm, I'm short of words, but, but I just can't wonder that people are actually doing this. Keep Thank doing this so that they will hear. Thank they don't, you. They don't want to listen. They are hearing. They don't want to listen. The Thank you very much. To Abuja online is, Mess. Thank you very much, online. Benga. Thank because you for your thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank All right, now, if you, if you look, um, I understand the last, like a decimal attitude, according mm -hmm. to, to people. We still get um, um, another call okay. out of the oh, line, Obuna. Oh, good morning, Obuna, from Enugu. Yeah, good morning. Good morning, sir. You're welcome. You Go ahead, sir. We, we can not... hear you. Make your point, sir. Yeah. Yeah, we are not seeing, we are not seeing any picture. We are not seeing you people. We are only hearing voice. Oh. oh. Okay. Okay, we'll they call us from I... where, please? Enugu. Eh? Where did they call us uh, from? Yeah. I'm calling from Enugu. From okay, Enugu. We'll okay, talk okay, to our right. technical people. Yes, technical people. Um, they said they can't address. see us in Enugu. Enugu. So please, make sure our visuals our back. All right. Oh, but, um, the but, um, DSTV people. Now, no, 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 no. What they talk about, what they talk about employment and the youth and um, the elderly people. But inside Nigeria, make we, we understand, say, government get their own role to play. We understand, say, our educational sector, no, they okay. We get a lot of youth where they talk, say, no, they, in quotes, employable. Mm -hmm. Now, thank God, sometime next week, we'll get the Lagos State Edu Ed Employment Trust Fund, LSETF, to come, come inside the studio, come tell us some things about employability for youth. But a lot of graduates, Lolo, a lot of graduates, the band and um, Bernard, cannot defend their, their certificates. certificates. Now, if they yeah. give them so opportunities who are you going to, to go... Who, no, no, no. You, the fact, you know what it is. On the other hand, we still get yeah. a lot of graduates where mm -hmm. they come outside of these same universities where so they do well. Mm -hmm. We still get a, in the same system where we know they don't do rotten. Mm -hmm. We still get people where if you come outside, we know why they go inside that same rotten That's system. Cool. But at the other hand, we still get a lot of people where still come outside. You go know because when they go for interview, you go know say this one either buying certificates. A lot of two ones nowadays are bought. Man, I even want to add I mean, to what, what the chief is talking about. Even those that are in service, how well serviced are they? Yeah. Because some of these old people, where would they talk? Look, it depends on where that person they work. You go see, see some old people, they never go for one training in for 15 one. years. Yes. That means they are as obsolete as IBM typewriter. Mm -hmm. So, and now you are saying your people know, make them not replace them. So how do you balance out some, some things? Uh, okay. But you know what it is? Yes. Okay. Before, okay. before we go on, because of time, we're going, <laughs> okay. to, we're going to do it. We're going to need to pass more break. By the time we'll come back, top of the hour, we'll get our news. And of course, when we come back, we'll see the continue on top of the story. No go anywhere. You must we, remember we my question. Back. Exactly. <laughs> but that's the truth. It's so the truth. People are buying it. They're buying it. It's uh, even the older ones, ones they are on their floor. Yes, so welcome again. You see, there on top of the Good Morning I just showed this beautiful morning. I will still get our two guests, our in-house analyst, Mr. Dakbo and Ben Akede. Will they discuss uh, the, the, the pronouncement where the people may say, make older people, may they retire early, or may they retire them, give the younger ones opportunity to do it and to take over for work so that the young generation will get work. And we have been looking at all the parameters, all the angles. We don't come bring her down to Nigeria. We they talk about how can we make this kind of thing work? Well, we know that foundationally, we get problem from the very beginning. A lot of people like to get into work. That means half of the people that are even in service are probably older. So you are saying 60, 
compose, uh, if you want to retire yourself, voluntary, voluntary. 65, if they retire you. Not knowing that these people already 87 working because of the football age. Do you think this system can be reworked to make it better? Uh, I, I believe that government needs to do what they have to do or what they need to do. The, the, our government, they are very, they, they're very insensitive to waiting they happen. They, it's like uh, when you say they are less concerned. They know just, they just believe, say, the system they there, they're not interested in rejigging the system to make sure, say, the system, they address the problem where we get. An example, a very clear cut example, we say, when you retire people, have you put something in place to make sure? Me, I follow my mama go Abuja mm. about eight years ago with a look for a file after she left service. Up to today, oh, my mama yeah. has not collected one naira as pension. And she don't leave service over 10 years ago. By the time when we reach Abuja, when we find out, say, one family member, they did there, we help us. He said, make we come, make I come with mama, I, I, we, we follow go. As we reach there, we come to look for our file. On the third day, we find my mama file inside the file where they put disease. They put disease on top. The woman, when she's still there alive, she's 74. She's still there alive. Our file, they don't close up. Somebody don't, they collect in a pension, pension. For, the, in, for the in the, the last, last 10 years. years. Imagine. Now, that, is a, mm. that system is not working. Eh, but it's now, obvious. We are saying we should keep older people there. Do you know that a lot of ministries, Many of these older people are not even coming. No, no, I'm issues. saying that people will continue lying mm. until they know, say, when they leave service, leave service. there is a life after, after, after that. We do so not, people will continue to thing, lie. You see, many things go, mm. you know, I don't understand. This is our country. Our problem is interrelated. Do you know this thing that we're talking about? We don't have data. Data is one of those things that help us to verify the veracity of what you talk. Our government, no, no, they don't talk, say they don't do... Um, BBL. BBL, do everything. They don't catch ghost workers. We see what they don't do, do everything. Do and they still pay pensions. Oh. Is pensions still pay? <laughs> for, for, for this part of the world, they be like, say, we still like to do things in the manual method. A lot yes. of things. You see, you see this paperwork where they talk? The problem. Mama's file was manually looked, looked for. Looked looked for. for. When, By when now, we should have a system that electronically works. done. You see, you see like now that all of us have graduated. You know why I say this thing is not rocket science? No, be rocket science. All of us have graduated. Ben has graduated. I've graduated. That means our name is in a system. Should, should be, be in a system. Be in a system. system. Be in a system. With the year where you graduate, you can't come and tell an employer. An employer should be able to sit on his chair and say, you said you went to Unilag. Unilag, what year? Uh, and your data will come out. Everything will just And you not say, but how come your birth certificate is reading this and this? Mm. From that one, you have already eliminated people that are lying about age. You see, one problem for this country, we believe, say, once we don't move something from paper to computer screen, a lot of people will lose their jobs. A lot, so people, they, first of all, people, they fear, say, you don't they replace them with computers. Computer. Without realizing, say, this thing is supposed to be, supposed to be you know, it's, it's, it is productive as regards counterproductive. Once everything don't enter, I mean, I don't talk this in several times, for TV, for what we they do side-by-side uh, -side talk, I don't talk before, say, like Mr. Dakwa, don't talk. Look, we have a very dysfunctional system for this country, such that you do BVN, the information where you give there, now the same one where you give when you do national ID card. Now the same information you they give when you they do driver's SIM license. Card the same one for SIM card registration. The same one for international passports. The same one for voters' registration. All these things are just duplication of information. If we get one system, where we say all this information enter inside, once you punch your name, everything about you suppose don't show. Now, it doesn't, this one don't mean say they go remove the people where they take hand the right arm. Yeah. As a matter of fact, just tell the people say, once you punch this, this thing don't enter. We go find way where these people go, still they useful to the society. Where we say, they no go they afraid, say, uh, no, if you hold this, what they one. do with yeah. Yeah. Say, Which one do you think will profit us more? Training the old where they there, mm. or replacing them? Which is more cost effective? Let's look at it on cost implication. Mm. Let us look at it. Which one do you think pays us more? Training the old or replacing them with people we know? Excuse me. Replacing them with people we know, they mean our youth of these days. We have plenty yeah, of no, them. No, no, look at it. So let's so. just look at it. If I'm saying let's look at man, it from those that are computer no, no, literate. If now old person, we don't do the system. Mm. We you don't train. We sabi the work. We don't do for that system for a very long time. Whether they do one by using system, my mama knows how to use computer. But if you bring manual printer now, 
Oh, pa 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 z da da da. Now, now the thing where they use where they use train them with that, and they still sabia. Now the thing we say when technology day. That I was talking about urban development. When technology can come, when computer come, which kind of training you give my mama to translate from manual typewriter to computer? If you not train them, the children of today, they have edge because from the onset, when technology come, they're not they used to yeah. manual and yeah. they meet computer. So trying to replace them is very unjust and is not fair. True. Because we, we did the system. You know, upgrade us, make we sabi this thing. You now won't come at me because somebody, because of, you don't introduce new technology into the system. I want to introduce and new And another people. person, no one. Exactly. It's not just. True. All right, we're going to leave our phone lines still exactly open. open. <laughs> for you to call us, check your mouth on top of this matter where they're hot for inside the studio. Now, now, waiting the pop don't come outside here and say, make the old ones, make them pave way inside the employment industry or inside even the prior status so that the younger ones fit to come in based on the unemployment rate waiting for inside Europe. And when they ask you the question, so you feel, say, if we bring and come from Europe, you go work for inside this part of the world. We'll control numbers now 01277 Type in as 01277 or 01277 Our toll-free number there for you to call us. That now 0800 Wazobia TV. All right, Bill, so we get all a right, call. We all get all Ambrose the way from, from Lagos. Lagos. Good, Good morning, morning, Ambrose. Hello. Good morning to you. Um, I won't contribute on top of the matter with the ground. All right, go, go ahead, ahead, sir. We hear you. Um, as we, as soon as the talk say, whether make uh, old people retire and then um, whether made uh, replace them with um, younger people, I didn't support say made uh, re uh, replace them because um, these older ones were there in these positions. Um, most of them supposed to leave legacy for us. As per se, all the time, they say the youth are the leaders of tomorrow. And then um, if then the fear say they no go pay them pension or they no get anything after the service as part from the government, and then um, make them make them try file these cases earlier on or talk about these things earlier on, like you know, come together and agree so that um, the government will be aware of what they really want. Punishing the younger ones for this um, um, for this wrong, problem yeah. is wrong. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to say that whether they should train the older ones. You can't just train. You can't just, you can't train the older ones. Instead, these older ones should be the ones training the younger ones. And if we, if we they think say the younger ones no go fee carry on this position well, before the older ones resign or retire, make them also train the younger ones for the position. Make them train them for the position so that they go know what thing they go on. So that um, they they not go stay longer for these places and leave us unemployed. Me, I'm also a youth and I'm undergrad I'm an undergraduate. So mm. now my contribution into the tour Thank you. made them Thank made you. Them train us. Yeah. You see that uh, coming for this uh, for yeah. this uh, thing where he won't talk. Mm. He said the whole people suppose train us. Mm. The whole person where you keep for keep for that you not train up. Where you not train and make you upgrade. <laughs> when you, you bring want the new person, where do you want like? What do my mama be forward? teach? Somebody where they come, not be man type man of course. Huh. Now man type. Are we taking up? ourselves back to the cave time? You see, that's is... why the whole people. It is so very unfair, and that's why they they are psych they are psyche not to keep staying inside that that's system. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, they will do everything to keep staying inside the system. Take, for example, the um, we we'll get one guest, we will come inside the studio, we talk about the judicial information system, that's not the court for inside Lagos yeah. State, how they don't try automate them, and some of the challenges where they will meet. Now, some of it, because of paperwork, because of the fear where some people true. get they may just to make sure they, they try to keep their work in place, they will try to compromise this new development. Wait, this we new get system. Larry on top of we'll the, the phone line. Good morning, Larry. Good morning, Larry. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Yeah. Go you ahead, see, Larry, to hear you, please. Yeah, I want to contribute to the situation on ground. Okay. You see, I used to ask myself this very question and others around me that who is fully who in Nigeria hmm. when it comes to unemployment matters? Because when you look at the system, the system is seriously faulty to the extent that, that we are we are not seeing any solution coming from any of our political office order. 
because they were oh, they were all in it about development, most especially here in Nigeria. He said, I'm a fresh graduate. So I just finished my NYSC last year. So when I, during the course of my NYSC, I asked myself that where am I going to? Who is going to give me a job? Even in the university that, I've taught, that, I've taught, that, that, that I went, I see them teaching me nothing. Because all what I've been taught, they, 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 they did not inculcate what we call marketing into it. That is how I will market myself at the end of my program. But all what they taught me is looking for job. That is after my service. So I ask myself, because I have the opportunity of watching one program yesterday that they call youth empowerment. When I look at the categories of people sitting there calling themselves youth, they are all who to who son and daughter. Hmm. That is those that were at the end Wow. Yeah. Hello, Larry. So, yeah. so when I when I, so when I said that, so when I said old oh, people should 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 not be incorporated into the employment system of Nigeria, it's like we are just fooling ourselves. Thank because you very much, Larry. Yeah, because, because of time, Larry, thank you. Thank you so thank much. You so much thank you so much, Larry. You know, same time, they always run, leave us. Mm. So on a final note, uh, Mr. Dako Banjo, what are your final thoughts on this one? My final thought would be, say, number one, make government. They responsible. This is, first of all, government problem. Make them day responsible. Create more jobs, more okay. employment opportunities, okay. mm -hmm. so that the younger ones fit, fit, um, fit, fit uh, get jobs the when they leave school. Okay. At the same time, keep training the older ones in the system and train them so that they can actually hand over to the new generation coming into the system. That's the number two thing. And number three, make sure, see, the older ones, as you are getting them off the system, then salary, where would they call pension, where you suppose they pay them, is regular. Wow. So that they will be very happy they have retired, okay. they've handed over to a new generation, and they are happy sitting at home. So, Bernard. Well, um, uh, Mr. Dakwado already played the last card, so uh, there's, there's hardly much. I know, I know exactly, I know go use. But, but me, I'm going to use my own last card, take us back to the beginning where we start. I'll go use, um, I know this is an irony, but I will play devil's advocate for the poop. Um, the reason why the Pope can, can come out at age 80 to say that is because the little way I know about the Pope and the papacy, they say they get age limit, first of all, where you guys reach before they confit elect you to become a Pope amongst the cardinals we did there. And let's not forget, say, the Pope himself now custodian of a particular history, tradition, and knowledge. So they're not going to trust that one into the hands of a young person. I make at age right. 80. If you come out, say, make young people do job. And if you take gala, say, may I still be young man. Thank you so much, Ben. We appreciate We go back a small break. By the time when we come back, now just to say bye-bye. So make you the listen, make you the watch every time on top of Zobia TV. Make you the watch Good Morning Niger and Prince. Now you talk. Yes, thank you very much. Say so you don't join us on top of the show today. Before we go, I want to say happy, happy birthday to Commodore Amoda. And uh, Esso Benita, uh, say make we say happy birthday to you. The shout out now from Esso Benita. And uh, Commodore Amoda, now inside Nigeria Navy, now he day. Good. Now, so me, I see her this morning, tomorrow, now another day. All right, and don't forget to say tomorrow will be the last day of the week and of the month. Friday, Friday, we're going to give you your balanced diet of teletainment. I remain Luchi in a moment. You get better day. Nice one. Monday is trending. Yes, on the Friday. On the Friday, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> to enjoy more of this, our will go get videos when you just watch. Press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.